This weekend, downtown turned into a sea of pink. It was a moment of empowerment for some 250,000 Chicagoans. Now, participants in the Women's March say that was just the beginning. Organizers say there is much more to come. CBS 2's Marissa Bailey headed out today to ask the inevitable question, what's next? Welcome to the Women's March on Chicago! Saturday's Women's March in Chicago was bigger, more well attended, and filled with so much passion, it begs the question, what's next? I think it's indicative of um, a lot of new movement. These women say they organized the March for Change. The turnout showed that there are many people out there who want to make their voices heard, have something to say, have a fear, have a protest, um, are moved enough to get out of their houses, go downtown on a Saturday, join others, and try to connect to make a difference the next day. You have to be invested for the long term if you really want to make things change. Political science professor William Adler says the march was momentum. But marchers need to commit to becoming activists. Voting is the cornerstone of the process. That's the, that's the first thing you have to do. <laughs> you can build on that. You can write to your congressman. You can call. You can tweet. Adler says congressional offices keep track of calls and emails. Reaching out to your representative just to voice your opinion is a good place to start. They keep track if you call the district office or the Washington, D.C. office. Somebody's been told, just keep a running tally of how many people call on this side or on that side. And another option, callparty.org is creating a Facebook Messenger app to send out a political issue each week that needs attention. The message is set to include a script and information to connect to your congressional representative to get your voices heard. Robin Erica, the important thing about this particular website that we can tell you is that at this point, it hasn't been created yet. It's still in its infancy, and we're told that there is, it's likely that you'll see more of these websites as time goes on. All right, some next steps. Thank you, Marissa.